actually an engineering student, and um, actually, he's on my textbooks right now. Principles of heat and mass transfer. There's another one, thermodynamics, and some calculus. Everyone's favorite. But anyway, I think that the skills you learn in engineering translate really well into entrepreneurship or making money. You know, just going out there into the world and solving problems. Because in engineering, the discipline I'm doing is mechanical engineering, we have a very laid out set process to solving different problems. Whether it be a dynamics problem or a statics problem, there's a number of steps that you have to do before you solve it to make sure you understand the variables or the parameters at play. And then there's a process that we follow. This is exactly the same with when you're studying new things. You need to logically decipher what is the appropriate move to do next. And to do that, you need to have an open mind, an objective mind. Anyway, in, um, Rich Dad Poor Dad, one of my favorite books of all time. I think I actually have it here. Robert speaks about something similar to this. He says that the rich don't say they can't afford it. They change the mentality completely and change the wording around and think, oh, how can I afford it? See, it's going from a reactive type of mind frame to an active type of mind frame. Just accepting things to instead of looking at things with that engineering mindset and changing it. So when you're out there in the world, you need to look at things objectively and think of how you can solve the problem. Don't always accept things as they are. If you don't make as much money as you currently want, don't just accept it. Look at your alternatives, look at your options. Possibly you can get a raise. What do you need to do to get a raise? Do you need to improve your education? Or do you need to pick up more hours? Or do you need to get a different job altogether? Do you need to start your own business? Do you need to sell some old things that you have lying around in your garage? You need to think about these things objectively. Don't just accept it as it is. So this is a key mentality that you should pick up if you want to be really successful. Is be a problem solver. Solve shit. Get it done.